And I'm Shelby Anderson. And we'd like to invite you to participate in our research project here at Lecom School of Dental Medicine. I'm sure this is a familiar picture, the evolution of man. But how does this relate to our project? We want to talk about working distance. Working distance is the amount of space between the operator's eyes and the visual target. Take a look into any simulation lab in probably any dental school and you may see something similar. Before there was four-handed dentistry, clinicians have been operating in a variety of styles. Like everything around us, dentistry has evolved, including how we position ourselves in the operatory. Ever since the dawn of civilization, we've been keeping up with technology, and the same is true with dentistry today. So where are we at today? Magnification is increasing in popularity, and research has shown that with magnification, you can help improve your ergonomics. But dental loops alone don't guarantee proper ergonomics. Correct. So what we hope to do with our research project is to take a couple of anatomic measurements of your arm to hypothesize your working distance. That is based on completely neutral seating position, which most likely we will not keep the, our entire career. The participant will be instructed into neutral ergonomic position. The measurements will be made using an L-shaped carpenter's ruler. The ruler will be placed into the anticubital fossa against the arm to measure up to the lateral epicanthus. Next, we will measure from the anticubital fossa to the occlusal surface of the chosen tooth. To measure your actual working distance, we will use a flexible tape measure from the lateral epicanthus to the occlusal surface of the chosen tooth. For your safety, the ruler edges are protected and will be disinfected before and after each use. There will be minimal touching of subjects by the investigators to the arm and head area. We anticipate up to five minutes of time to gather the information. So whether or not you already have loops, instead of taking a measurement at a coffee shop, we'd like to find your most ideal, individualized working distance. For more information about the working distance investigation, please contact the principal investigators or student researchers. And open your eyes to research. Thank you.